This is a 1978 Honda Express moped, and I'm so excited to fix this thing. It looks pretty awesome. I uh, haven't had much experience with two strokes, but I mean, it's fine. I'll figure it out. And the guy does want this back. This is not mine. So I'm doing what the guy tells me to do. I'm not like doing a full restoration on this thing. And um, hopefully I can get it running. This thing actually like barely runs. I put new oil and new gas in it and was like kind of hoping it would run and uh, it actually kind of does run. It's just like really bad and it's leaking oil everywhere. So um, to start this thing is actually really cool though. You go ahead and crank up the kickstart a couple times until it stops and then you grab the handle and it tries to kick it over. So I'm gonna go ahead and kick this thing over. Okay, so I just tried to start this thing for like five minutes and uh, the kill switch was on, so that's on me. Uh, it's really, it's like really smoky. I got a flashlight, like you can see like the beam. That's how smoky it is. It's everywhere, like. Okay, so this thing is like running trash and it is absolutely blowing oil and smoke all over the garage right now. Like, it's out the back of the garage, so. So as you saw, this thing's blowing smoke, not running right, leaking oil everywhere. So um, I'm going to go ahead and fix this thing up. Hey, I'm going to set up a light here just so it's a little easier for y'all to see what I'm doing. Okay, so it actually looks like someone's been in this car before. There was one new screw and one completely stripped out. So someone's tried to do this before. I don't think they knew what was happening. And uh, it actually doesn't look that bad on the inside. I'm still gonna go ahead and take this whole thing apart and clean out all the jets because uh, there's obviously some like. Okay, so these jets aren't removable, so I'm just gonna have to clean them in the card. So I'm just sticking a guitar string in them just to clean them out. And uh, that normally works pretty well. And uh, I don't know if you can see the string or not, but it's like going all the way through, so that jet's clean. And then the pilot jet is up next. This thing is probably destroyed because it was not idling like whatsoever. It would just die when you took the choke off, so both these were probably clogged. Now that you can see through all the holes on this thing, uh, except for the pilot jet, that thing's just too small to show up on camera, but I can see through it. I'm gonna go ahead and clean out the bowl and put this thing back together and see how it runs. Okay, so this thing definitely sounds a ton better. It still sounds a little off, but um, it definitely sounds a lot better than it was. And it's definitely idling now. Like it, it actually idles now. So, carpet's definitely a huge fix. It's still gonna be blowing oil, and I still have to clean it up. So I'm gonna go ahead and get on both those things. Okay, first, because this thing's running so awesome, I'm just gonna have to ride it for a second. So, uh, I'll, I'll be back.
Okay, so this thing is done. Speedometer's working, lights working, it runs first kick every time. Everything's clean, it's got new oils, and it's not leaking anything. But uh, this was so fun. I actually think I'm gonna buy an old moped. Not maybe not like this exact one, but like I'm looking at old mopeds to buy and do a full restoration on. So hopefully that's in an upcoming video. And uh, that's basically it.